Okay, I'm really excited to have received this new Centurion LGA developer kit. It comes, as you can see, in two pieces, in two boxes, uh, one with a label and one without. First of all, if we just have a quick look at the box with the label on and see what's in there. We have, okay, we have the new dev kit in, uh, in its anti-static bag. We have some cables here. Okay, let's just take these out and have a quick look. Okay, we have a, uh, uh, a mini USB cable here. Uh, we have uh, the antenna cable. That must be to connect the dev kit to the antenna, I guess. And... Okay, we have some jumpers. Not sure why we need those, but I'm sure we'll find out later on. Ah, and the antenna. So this is a really nice antenna. A really nice wideband antenna. Let's take this out of the bag. And you can see here we have 700 megahertz to 2800 megahertz. So that's a really good 2G, 3G, 4G antenna, which obviously must get connected to this cable somehow. So we'll have a look at that in a minute. And in the anti-static bag, we have the brand new LGA dev kit, which I guess goes around that way. Okay, there are two versions of this board, and you can see this one is designed for the small and medium uh, size modules. Uh, we need some adapters for those, which I guess will be in the other box. Uh, yeah, great. So here we have the 80-way connector, big 80-way connector for the DSB 75 and the mini DSB. And down here we have a standard SIM card holder. So that's not for nano SIMs. It's not for the uh, micro SIMs or whatever. That's the, uh, the old standard SIMs. And a QR code here. QR code which will take us to, I think, a website with uh, some videos and things. And we'll have a look at that later on. But yeah, really nice. So, and so what's in the other box? Let's have a look. I really don't know. So in the other box we have some, okay, we have some adapters and this sort of pressure cap or whatever that you need to push down on top of the LGA parts. And what else do we have here? Uh, and this, this is uh, this is the uh, little bed of nails, which is what actually connects to the, to the module, to the cellular module. So somehow that's going to go on there. And from these parts that we have, that will be the pressure part to go on the top. And we have some adapters. We have some adapters for the different modules. Um, and we'll have a look at those in just a moment, how we use those when we put everything together.